silence is not the absence of communications. Silence is not the refusal of the bombardment of communications that we experience every day. Silence is, however, an integral part of communication. I think silence itself is communicative. We think so often we're lost for words. Somebody has died, we're trying to express our sympathy. Often silence is the most effective thing. It can be an expression of our closeness, of our nearness, of our solidarity. Silence is also, I think, a mark of respect for the other person. And in many ways, it's a way of showing our love for the other person in the communicative process. I'm willing to stop and listen. I think the Pope picks up this point and he says, look, people are asking all sorts of questions. Some of them may seem very trivial. Some of them seem more important. But behind it all, it is to remember that human beings are questioners. It's in our nature to ask questions. And ultimately, maybe the big question we're always asking is, what's it all about? <laughs> Where is it going? What's my life about? Where can I find hope? What's worth giving myself to? And in fact, the answers to some of those questions are found in silence. That rather than trying to throw the person an easy answer or trying to rush a response, it's actually to have the confidence to allow that person to go deeply with the question, to think on the question, to bear with it and find in the depths of their own being the answers to who they are.